Hi guys, Kyung here, and we're gonna um, do the next pages of our Easy Peasy Envelope Journal. Um, I think we're on pages five and six. So let's see, one, two, three, four, five. Oh wow, so six and seven actually. So I have some ideas, but the first thing we need to do is fill this pocket with a journaling card. That's what we need to do. So um, I've already cut this out, right? It's a, just a half, it's a half of a page of one of the, um, right, just like the journaling pages. And I figure we decorate it. So let me move this aside. And let's see, let's grab our, I kind of organized my trims, if you can't tell. It was a little ridiculous. Um, but I was thinking I might like to maybe do some Rick Rack. Maybe put some Rick Rack down the side like that. Maybe put some fabric, uh, like a strip of fabric. That might be really nice. Let's see. Um, hmm. We have this one. How would that look? Kind of drowns it out, doesn't it? The black one. And it's holly too. I think let's do that. I really like that. And it's, it kind of really looks, it matches really well. So we'll cut a piece of that. Um, <clears throat> so I'm trying, I'm hoping to try to maybe do three or three, <laughs> two pages a day, get it done by the end of the month. If not, I bleed a couple days um, into August. But, um, so <laughs> I'll have to tell you about my eBay adventures. So I'm on eBay and I'm looking, I decided to look for apothecary tape, you know, the apothecary cabinets, aren't they beautiful? Aren't they like every crafter's dream <laughs> for their like crafting station, right? Is to have those like really nice apothecary tables. So I'm looking at them, right? And gosh, they're so expensive, you know? And then I go and I look, start looking at shoe boxes to put my crafts in anyway. And I stopped to think to myself and I thought, really? You go from one extreme to completely the other side of the extreme. You go from apothecary tables <laughs> to shoe boxes. Like, really? <laughs> oh, so I was like, just stop. So I just, I left. I left eBay, but um, speaking of eBay, I did, I was kind of looking around at books as I do, and um, I found another train book, <laughs> so I ordered it, and then I ordered a couple of other books, you know, to go with it, because you can't just order one book, you know, you have to order multiple books. <laughs> I got a really good deal on them, though. They were like, buy three, get one free, so... Um, I've actually got a few books. I found a few books in the past few days. So what I'm thinking I might do is in a week or two, I might do like a book share, do like a little video and share, share my book finds, the fancy books I have found over the past few weeks. Okay. So there we go. There's that. I think it definitely needs inked. Let's do some red ink, some festive berries. Um, well, doesn't that look nice? I think so. Okay, so what else should we put on it? We're definitely going to put some Rick Rack, right? Definitely put some Rick Rack. So it's so weird. You know, Halloween... It's really weird. So Halloween is coming. <laughs> it doesn't seem like it, but it is. And I'm going to try to, I'm thinking, um, in October, when it does come, I'm going to do uh, an, like an Alice thing, right? So I have this idea for a red Alice digital kit. And so what I, what I decided I'm going to do is I'm going to like print them out 
and I have an old Alice in Wonderland book, like a, like an old vintage one. And it's actually the one I had from when I was a childhood. And so I would love to use it in a journal. Um, so I think that's what I'm going to do. Uh, let's, I love these little die cuts of like the gift. We could put one. We could put one. We could put one with a quote and maybe a ribbon. Right? We have a bow. We could maybe put a bow on there. Let's look at our words, shall we? So yeah, I'm thinking, uh, so for October, I mean, that's a ways away, but I'm thinking that's what I'll do. Gifts of time and love. Okay. Um, could we get away with a big one, do you think? I mean, I'm thinking we could get away with a big one. <clears throat> That's what I think, but I think we need to cut out these black lines, is what I think. And ink it. You know, this, this ink reminds me of lipstick. It's color. It reminds me of lipstick. They could have called it lipstick, I feel like. But I mean, then of course you wouldn't get the holiday sales, I suppose, right? <laughs> I'm going to use Fabri-Tac because it's uh, probably will go a little bit on the fabric right there. Move it up just a little bit because I'm going to stitch around it, around the whole card. I'll do that off camera though. Okay, let's put this on there. I think for this one I'll use my art glitter glue because it's... Cute little die cuts. This was like a little embellishment pack that I bought from, oh, I want to say the shop name is called Embellish Bliss. I'll look and I'll put it in the description below. But um, she does these cute little um, embellishment packs. And uh, oh, she had the cutest ones for Christmas. So that's where I got this from, this little die cut. Okay. I love it. I think it's good. We could put a ribbon, right? We could put a little bow on here and call it good. There we go. Maybe that's fine. Maybe we'll put it down a little lower anyway. Come on. Stick to the thing, not to my finger. <laughs> okay. Yes. There we go, ta-da, a journaling card. And we'll stick it in there with a Christmas card. Let's see, what do we have for Christmas cards? Goodness gracious. Okay, we have these birds. Oh, I like this one. Ooh, I'm gonna do something with one of these too. I love that they're like, it's like a window. Isn't that awesome? I'm gonna do something with this, with these. But for now, we'll use this and we'll put this in with our pocket, with our journaling card, into our pocket. Not with our pocket, into our pocket. <laughs> there we go. And there's our journaling card. Now to move on to the actual page. Put these back. Oh, and look at the polar bears. How cute. Okay, just sit right there and be good. Um, what are we doing? What are we doing? Oh yes, this. So I have this page and I really like the tree in it and I like the quality of the tree, right? Of the image of the tree. Um, so I'm thinking I'm going to back it onto some cardstock, right? and then I'm going to cut it out. And what I think I'll do is I'll cut it out first. Okay, my goodness, wasn't that a pain? Okay, now we're good. Let's glue this down. Oh, 
glue this down. So yeah, I'm thinking in September I'll do a line dot arrow journal with a line with Nat like I have three Natalie's kits. So I think I'll use those and make a journal. Um, and I think that that will be fun because they are beautiful and I'd love to do something with them. So I think that's the plan for September alongside while I do the September daily in um, Miss Paint-A-Lot's group. Uh, Miss Paint-A-Lot on her channel is going to be doing a September daily. So I'm going to be doing that and I won't be doing any videos, but I'll be my progress in the group and so I thought for videos I might do a line dot arrow uh, journal so I think that's the plan for September August is gonna be all train I think train and then I've got me and Terry have the page by page project that we're doing and so we're gonna continue with that and so that'll continue not this Friday but next Friday that will continue as normal. I'm thinking green on this one, yeah. To ink it green. Hmm. I'm thinking I'm gonna do it like this. And then do some stronger just down the edge. There we go. Okay, so here is our tree. And it's just going to be a pocket. It's going to go here. Right? And then we're going to make baubles. Baubles to go in there. That's what I think. Um, but what should we do for a page to put behind it? Hmm? We could use this, right? Which is a remnant of the journaling card, right? I kind of like that. And then you could write too. I could write, you could use it as like to be able to write. I think that's what we'll do. We'll keep it simple, yeah. We'll cut it here. straight does it I don't know now it does no I don't know <laughs> okay put some red border on here glue it on there. Make sure to get the edges because I don't want the edges coming up over the sides. Okay. So yeah, I'm in the market for shoe boxes, I guess. <laughs> so funny because um, I've got these little tiny boxes that I'm using right for my lace and my fabric and it's, it's just not cutting it so I was thinking ooh, what if I got one of those really cool pocket theory tables <laughs> yeah that's not happening oh gosh they, I was like wow <laughs> they are expensive um, I'll keep an eye out, you know, you never know, you may find a beat up one, you know. Should just put it all the way down, I think, yes. So, we're going to glue it like this. Just a little bit at the top, all the way down the side. 
nothing along the bottom. Okay. There we go. Good deal. Awesome. And then I have these. I think I want to maybe do something with. So there are a couple of... A little star. Oh, this one is. But we can cut it off of there. Right? This chipboard. Get our Tim Holtz scissors out, huh? That'll do the trick. That'll do it. We have to cut ourselves in the process. Ta-da! What if we just glued that on there? Isn't that cute? Dum -da -dum. <clears throat> I'm just gonna use fabric tech because it's just cardboard. It'll stick good. Okay, there we go. A star on top of the tree and then I think I saw a little joy let's just dump them out shall we let's make a mess <laughs> that's cool like this tag here we go a little joy joy should go down here we're thinking it, it should go down there Yes. Cool. So we have some decoration on our page. Joy. Yeah, I'll move it over. Right? Yeah, it's fine. It's good. Okay, we'll move all this off to the side <laughs> we'll just push it off for right now um so what i want to do is make baubles right so let me grab my my big circle punch okay and we have my big i think it's a two inch circle punch not sure not sure but we have some cardstock right here and we're just gonna punch out some circles Right. One, two, three, and then you know what? Because they're they're they are kind of small, aren't they? So we'll we'll do that. But hold on one second. Give me one second. Okay, here we go. We have a couple of big circles now, right? That we can go put in there. I cut um I cut them with my big shot and um, some circle dies that I had, like some nesting dies. So let's decorate them, huh? Um, I think I'll leave this one out. We'll do two and two. Um, so what I wanna do first is grab a piece of cardstock and put little ends on them. So, like this, do those two longer, and we'll glue these on there, right? Those are like the things that the like hooks hang on. So I can't remember if we made these um, oh, in the little golden journal book, in the little, go the little golden book, Christmas journal, or the easy peasy envelope, or if I saw this somewhere else. Um, so cause, because, okay, so I have all this washi tape. Okay, anyway, I have all this washi tape and... What I would like to do 
is use some of it up, right? And decorate these baubles. So we're just going to do that, right? We're going to take our washi tape and we're going to put it over. We're, we're going to need to glue it first. We're going to need to put some glue, right? Just because otherwise it won't want to stick. <laughs> okay. Put some glue. Flip. Let's put some of this gold on there. Where's the end? Where's the end? This will be a gold ornament. Yeah, if we can if we can accomplish that. This is really pretty. I should pull this out from the Christmas stuff because I could use that in other things right that would have been really pretty in like the romance journal oh look at this one too that's gorgeous this like leafy oh it's got that backing on it okay Ta -da. oh it already looks pretty Let's see, we have stars. We can put those on there. Come on, stars, where's your end? I haven't used these a lot. These are kind of new. Let's see, we have some silver. Red and gold. Oh, here's a thin gold. Let's use some of that. Yay. Um, let's see. We'll go ahead and start repeating, I guess. Might as well. that down so right now let's see I'm working on in the digital realm I'm working on a floral music cover kit so that'll be coming out very soon um, okay and we just want to lift this up like that turn it over and trim off all of our um right all of our all the excess tape just trim it all off and i'm not going to use my tim holt scissors okay so I'm going to use my not good scissors, just trim around, try not to cut my cardstock if I can help it. <laughs> <laughs> I just turned all the way around for no reason. Come on. Oh, I hate when it does that. Get all the tape off our... <laughs> it's a mess. <laughs> okay. Back to what we were doing. Okay, okay, I'll get you out. I guess we could cut it from the side, huh? Ta-da! Oh, look at that. It's an ornament. Isn't it so pretty? It's all shiny and everything. It's totally uh, an ornament, a Christmas bauble, or whatever you want to call it. Um, I love it. Let's do something with this top. Hmm? Shouldn't we? 
I think so. Uh, what to do, though, right? That's the question. I have my Crayolas. I have my Crayola crayons or crayons. Oh, my goodness. Here, we'll just grab some gray. Right, markers. Markers is the word. We'll just go like this. Boom, 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 boom. Just make lines up and down, up and down. Ta-da! Yay, it's a bobble. Okay, and then one more thing. So I want to poke a hole. Let's see. In the middle. Okay. And then... Right. Oh, how cute. Then let's put like a something in it. Okay. Sorry about that. Anyway, so I have these little tiny, these little tiny, oh, look at how cute they are. Oh, look at how cute these little tiny safety pins. They're so cute. What if we just put them up in there like that? Right? Ta-da! And then we have a Christmas bauble. And then in the on the back, right, we can just ink it. Let's grab our thing that we're using. <laughs> That's its official um, name, a thing. I'm going to try to go around it and try to be gentle with my foam brush as I don't I don't have any like extra like makeup brushes. That's not too bad. Right, not too bad. There. Then you could write on the back of it or put a picture or whatever. Whatever you want to do. I guess whatever I want to do, considering I will be the one using the journal come Christmas time. Yay, look, and then it goes in there. And then, right, and then we'll put another one here. Right, or like, yeah, probably up like this. And then another one here. And then another one here, like that. Right, so we have, and I don't know, I may do the, th this, the, the second little one. I may not. Um, but, uh, I'll do that, um, the rest of these off camera, you get the idea, we're just going to cover them in washi tape, um, fun stuff, and a great use for all the washi tape, <laughs> there's so much, and I, I don't ever, like, use it really all that often, you know? Okay, so onward to the next page, um, what, what are we going to do? What are we going to do? Uh, I have taking these out. So what I'd like to do is either use this page or this page. I'm trying to decide which one I like better. I think this one. Right, so I think we're going to go blue on this page and And cut it there. So this page is going to be just a simple pocket. A simple pocket. Um, do I? I don't even have. I don't have my blue. Oh no! But I do have my vintage photo. So which we've been using a little bit of here and there throughout the journal. So we can stick with that. Yes, a simple pocket. I want to use this, um, these, this coach. I want to use one of these, I think the blue one. And it's a little large, isn't it? Um, 
I'll have to cut off the back of the carriage, but that's okay. That's fine. Uh, do, do, do. We'll use my Fabri-Tac. Why not? Okay. It's actually, again, being very nice to me today. So, I'm happy about that. <laughs> Thank you again, everyone, for, um, first of all, for, you know, hanging out with me and all that stuff. And then also everyone who's, like, participated in the event. I think it's really cool. It's been a lot of fun. I really glued that on crooked. <laughs> we have time. We have time. I always glue things on crooked the first time, don't I? Only when recording. <laughs> I promise I don't have this problem normally, she says. Okay, let's use our glue eraser. Okay. Wonderful. I want to make a pocket out of this. I want to put him on it. That's kind of the idea. I want to put him... I mean... Hmm... I don't know. Yeah, let me fussy cut him out, and then I'll be right back. Okay, so we have him all cut out. The things we do, huh? <laughs> so this is going to go on here. Like this. And it's going to be a pocket. It's going to be quite the big pocket, isn't it? That's okay. Who doesn't like a big pocket every once in a while, huh? That's what I say. Okay, we'll cut it there. And then I think I'll fold over the top part. Um, where is, here it is. Yeah, so I'm thinking what I will do is I'll fold over the top part about this much, give it some good heft, you know. And then we'll cut it here. Yes, 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 yes. That would work perfect. Okay, let's glue this part down. Glue this flap. Okay. okay, let's ink it. Just a bit, just to take off that white. I mean, it's not the sturdiest pocket and I don't really want to back it. Um, so it's going to be what it's going to be. That's okay with me. The question is, do I ink the kid? Probably. Probably. Just a little bit, huh? Especially, I feel like, in the tree. The tree's pretty rough. And I feel like here, within the horses, it's a little less, you know, bad. And you gotta be careful, too, like, around the mouth and the... Their legs are pretty good. They were a pain, man. This was a pain. To, I don't... <laughs> About halfway through, I thought to myself, what am I doing? <laughs> okay. Yep. That's going on there. It's going... You know what, though? Before. Before we do that, really quick. Let's put a doily on it. And I think I'm going to do a white. Here, I'll use one of these. I think these are Dollar Tree doilies. Yeah, that's going to really make a difference, I think, in everything. 
feel like I need to make maybe a little bit fold. Fold it just a little bit. Okay, and I know where to glue. Okay, put some glue on there. On the roses and the lace. On the lace, not on the... <laughs> okay. Yeah, about right like that. There we go. We'll just cut the excess off. All this washi tape. Washi tape st stuck. It's stuck. All right. Get this on there. Ooh, look at how it seeped through. That's not good. That's not good. It does look better. And then we'll put uh, something on it. I wasn't... Usually, um, art glitter glue does pretty good with... Uh, leaking through things but I don't I need to order more uh, glue stick of my glue sticks so I just don't really have anything else okay I have my cosmic shimmer but I don't think I mean, I think that it would definitely seep through. If the arc glitter glue seeps through, then the cosmic shimmer definitely would. I think. Let's grab my towel. Look at that. Oh, that looks great. He looks great on there. Let's definitely put something up here. Let's see, what do we have? I have these like 3D things. Right? Snow. That thing. I have these. What is this? It's not, won't fit. Too big. Hmm, these ones are too big. I bet the other ones are probably too small, huh? Oh no, they kind of fit perfect, don't they? What about this one? And open a jar of it every month. Oh, that fits, right? We are making this in July. Speaking of, so it's weird going backwards, right? Like, I'm thinking about Halloween, yet I'm doing Christmas. And usually it's the other way around, right? I usually do Halloween, and I don't think about Christmas until Halloween is done. <laughs> and once Halloween's done, then I will, right, move to, you know, then I'll move to, uh, to Christmas stuff. Normally. Normally, anyway. Some blue would be nice. Some blue something. Let's see what I have. I have some scrap. I have this. Put just a little bit. Of that on there like that. Put that on there like that. And then put a couple of little snowflakes. I think that'll look great. I think that will be fine. We have those little blue snowflakes. I think we'll be perfect. Let's cut off this black line. Cut it off, I say. Off with you. I 
I wish I could put up some of the Christmas spirit in jars and open a jar of it every month. Stick this on there. Stick this on there like that. Okay, and then let's put a couple of snowflakes on it. So I have these blue ones. And I think they'd be perfect, right? We'll put a blue one there and we'll put a blue one there. And that'll be, oh, it's so perfect. And then I have my, so originally this boy did not come in this. He didn't come in this. There was a girl There was like an angel, like a girl. And um, the problem was she didn't really match the rest of the kit but I really wanted to use the um the carriage also the tree I think I put the tree in there I'm not <laughs> I'm not 100% sure but um quite a bit of editing was put into this image um but I felt bad for taking the poor angel out of there because she really just didn't match you know and so I put made sure to put an angel in the kit you know to replace her because because I felt bad. There we go. And now we're just going to glue it right onto the page. Like this. Doom, doom. Right onto the page like that. Get it on there all straight and even. Looking good. Yep, looking good. I like it. I like it. Now we just need to put something in it, right? So I have some scraps, and it might actually be cool to put some scraps, like Christmas, oops, some Christmas scraps in there, right? So, like, I have this, right? You put that in there. Um, what else do I have? I have this one, right? That can go in there. It's like almost a tag already. Just cut the corners at the top, decorate it. Right, let's put some blue. We have more of these. That won't really work. Um, let's see, what else do we have in here? Those are again... The red is too red to put in there. Oh, this is cute. We'll put that in there. Cut off the... Fold it up. Yay! So there we go. Right? And then all we have to do is just, right, make another journaling card and put a Christmas card in there. So we'll do that next time. But um, there we have our next two pages. Fancy. And then I'll finish up these baubles and get them in here. So, yay! I hope you had fun. I had fun. <laughs> I've been really enjoying this project. I kind of came in and tried to color a little bit, add a little bit of color, um, gave it an interesting feel to it. So anyway, that's it for today. I will see you tomorrow and um, have a great rest of your day or week or whatever. Anyway, <laughs> bye. <laughs>